I struggle sometimes with motivation and being driven, but one thing that makes a difference is if I'm around people who are really driven and stuff. Gotta get it right now. Yeah, push over the limits with you right now. So we've decided on what we're gonna be doing with my hair. We've decided to do something a bit different. Now. Good morning everyone, it's currently 5.30 a.m. and Chelsea and I are literally just about to get out the door to head to Cronulla because we're actually going to a club this morning called the 5.30 Club. As you can tell, we're running a bit late, that's why we're leaving at 5.30. But we thought it would be a really good way to start the morning. We actually got invited by our friends Jess and Sophie yesterday, so we're going to be joining them and basically just kind of working in the morning. I think the whole idea of the club is just to like get the most out of your day, so you get up early, you start your work early, and then do whatever you want with the day. So we're actually gonna go to the gym afterwards, and I'm gonna try out going to fitness first because I haven't actually been there before like for a proper membership. I've only done like trials, but I'm gonna see if I can do like another trial or like a free session today because I kinda wanna try it out because I really wanna join a gym that is like a gym but also has classes because as you guys know, I loved the yoga retreat that I recently went on and I've decided that I wanna do yoga classes and Pilates classes. But obviously, if I did that and also went to a gym that didn't have classes, I'd be paying for two memberships. So I might as well go to a gym that does it all. Also, Chelsea's here. Where are you? Good morning, everyone. Chelsea's back here and she stayed over I'm last here. night. It was so cute. We literally sat in bed drinking our tea with our little books, like I know, old women. Grammars. I know, because we both have been sleeping so bad lately. So we're like, look, we need to get off our phones. We need to try and sleep. And I slept a bit better, but still not, still not great. Anyway, we need to go. So I'll see you guys at the club. Look away we are. Izzy came and joined us. We're going for a walk now though. So I think we're just gonna walk along the Esplanade. What's the time? Like seven? 6.50. 6.50. I was just saying before, I'm such an extroverted person that like for me, the best way to start my day is like with other people. Like it just puts me in a really good mood. So I'm loving the fact that we're like all out. I think we're all the same. That's what helps. Yeah. That's what we're like, yes, this is the best morning ever. Yeah, we're all like very driven people. And for me, like I struggle sometimes with motivation and being driven. But one thing that makes a difference is if I'm around people who are really driven and stuff. I did a caption on Instagram yesterday which said like you're the product of the top few people that you surround yourself with. But it actually is true. Like when you surround yourself with people who are kind of like what you want to be then you kind of just you pick up on the traits and stuff i think that's what it's we were good. talking about before how you know don't yeah. be afraid to just let go of some people if they're not bringing you the right energy mm. and making room for new friends and like what yeah. happened this morning yeah i know so nice it's actually put me in the best mood why did i wear my white shoes we're on our way to the gym now. We just finished our walk. I literally feel like such a fitness woman because <laughs> we're going to the gym and we've been for a walk. Like this is just not my usual morning, honestly. I'm really changing things up today, but it's inspiring good. me. It's yes. good. Very good. It is good. And it's only what, 7.30 right now? Yep. So we're coming to a really nice gym on the beach and I'm hoping that I'll be able to get a free trial at this gym because um, I'm thinking of maybe joining a fitness first. And hopefully I can keep up because you guys are so... We're doing a chill workout today though. We're doing a chill yeah. workout. Yeah. What's a chill workout though for you guys? It'll be chill. Okay. Maybe. <laughs> How nice is this view? <laughs> How nice is this high period pain? Oh, poor Sophie. Sophie's got like really bad period pain. Oh, I hope you don't mind me saying. No, honestly, I share it everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna do some mat exercises. We want yeah. something kind of gentle, okay? Gentle, flowy. Yes. Okay, so I just finished the workout, but I had to cut it short because I totally forgot that my hairdresser's appointment is at 9 a.m. Well, I didn't actually forget that I had it, but time just went by so fast. And I was like, oh my gosh, it's already 8.30. And I need to make it to the hairdressers. But luckily, I go to Bixie, and that's only in Carring Bar, so it's only like about a five minute, 10 minute drive away from here. But I need to pop home and grab some stuff beforehand. So it's 
gonna be a little bit of a rush, but we'll make it. But I really enjoyed that workout. That's my first time like doing like kind of a workout in a little while. I'm not gonna lie, I've kind of been a little bit turned off working out lately. Um, but it was really motivating to do it with someone else, with other people who know what they're doing. Um, so we're gonna go back tomorrow and hopefully obviously I can have a longer workout then, but I really enjoyed it. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I made it on time as well. We're in the salon. Here's Cherie. Do you wanna introduce yourself? I feel like you've never been in one Hi of my guys. vlogs. This is Cherie, she does my hair. She's the owner of Bixie and she's literally amazing. Oh, thank um, you. So how long have I been seeing you? For about nearly two years, I feel yeah. like. It feels like longer actually. Yeah, We've I done know. So many Awesome yeah. colors, right? You guys have seen me peach, pink, and like done so many colors, but um, yeah. I don't know what we're gonna do today. Mm. I don't know either. It's always like a surprise, like to be honest, we never really plan it. We kind of just come in and we're like, what should we do? <laughs> I do have a few ideas though. Oh, you do? Okay. Yeah. Oh, cool, nice. Hayley, Hayley's camera shy. Are you camera shy? Yes, yeah, camera okay. shy. Hayley's camera <laughs> shy, but she always does my makeup. So um, if you're wondering like who does my makeup when I come in, it's Hayley. She does an amazing job as well. We're not getting my makeup done today though. I'm gonna come in another time and do that. But I get my hair done. So we've decided on what we're gonna be doing with my hair, but I'm gonna like leave it as a surprise. We've decided to do something a bit different and I've wanted to do this for ages, but um, it's just like not being the right time. It's like something pretty out there. I'm really excited about it. A lot of you guys have told me to do this as well, actually. So Sheree's gonna work her magic and I'll show you guys the after. But right now my hair's looking really quite grassy. So we're gonna fix up the blonde and I'm also gonna buy a few products because I really, I need to take care of my hair better. It needs some love. It needs some love and it's getting that today. So take a mental picture because it's gonna look different in a minute. More like in five hours. It's about 5 p.m. and I finished having my hair done. I absolutely love it. I think it's my favorite color that I've ever gone. Um, as you guys can see, I'm currently in black and white because I don't want to give away the color. But in a second, I'm going to reveal the color so you guys can see it. I'm just being dramatic. But anyway, I'll just reveal it right now. So as you can see, I've gone like a purpley silver color, which I absolutely love it looks really purpley in this light but in some lights it looks more silver but i absolutely love it i've been wanting to do this color for ages but it was honestly really spontaneous but that always happens whenever i go to bixie like sheree and i just start talking We're like what should we do today let's do something different and then i was like oh i really want to do purple like purpley silver and then i showed her a bunch of like inspiration photos and then she's like we can do it excuse my dead flowers back there by the way got these for valentine's day but they're already dead. I'm not very good at looking after plants. I love it though. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. As you know, I've been peach and pink before and now I'm purple. So let me know which is your favorite color that I've been in the past. I think this is my favorite because I feel like it's the most wearable because I mean, in some lights, it kind of looks silver and I feel like it's the most kind of natural. You know what I mean? Even though it's not very natural looking. It's more wearable and I really, really like it. So I'm going to be twinning with my grandma because my grandma's got purple hair too. She's really excited about it. Um, so I'm actually going to be seeing her and the rest of my family tonight because it's actually my mom's birthday. So we're going to be going out for dinner. We're going to a place where my brother actually works and my brother's going to be doing the quiz night at the place he works. So it's going to be a lot of fun celebrating my mom's birthday and I can't wait to see their reactions. Oh, 
come join me. I thought this place was private, so I literally had like I was bending over and like what do you my freaking ass was. What do you mean private? Like like I had like I didn't think anyone was really gonna be around, so I was like getting stuff out of my car and my ass was private. Like, yeah. <laughs> like I thought no one would be walking. Just flash some strangers. Nothing oh. new. So it's now the next day. Sorry I didn't film much after I showed you guys my hair, but I just went out for dinner <laughs> with foot. <laughs> but we've had like a really productive morning. So this morning we got up at 5 a.m. again and we did like our own little 5.30 club, club, didn't we? We went to Loaf and we did some work in the cafe. We were really productive. And I got a lot done. I got a lot done too. We weren't going to, well, you wanted to go and I was like, I don't really have that much work to do. Turns out I do. Yeah. And I got a lot of it done. So I was really happy that we did that. And then we actually went to the gym afterwards and it was a really good workout. You're welcome. Yeah. Well, Chelsea literally... <laughs> orchestrated the whole workout because you know i just don't know what i'm it's like doing a full body mix of weights yeah but i really enjoyed it now chelsea and i have come out to the city and we're in Potts point because we're going to go to a pr showroom we're actually going to tailor made and we're going to pick up a few outfits which is exciting goodies. i thought it'd be really fun to film this because obviously like i've never vlogged going to like a showing before and you guys might be interested to see what a pr company looks like yeah. and how it works so we're going to pick up a few pieces of clothing and things so we can take photos in the clothes. They've got a few different brands at this PR company. They've got like General Pants, Guess, Steve Madden, Tiger Lily. So I feel like there's going to be a lot of nice things. And I'm excited to just be like put in a good mood again because I've had a little bit of a rough afternoon, haven't I, Chelsea? Yes. Yeah. Yes. But Chelsea. that's okay. Chelsea's been a good friend and it's been there for me. But Always. um yeah, I had like a little bit of a cry this afternoon because I've just like got a few kind of I guess you could say family issues going on at the moment um and i obviously won't talk about it because it's very personal but i just needed to have a cry so oh, i'm happy to just be out and be distracted Distract and with a good friend but it's just such a shame when you have like a nice morning and then like something can kind of just ruin your day like that but i'm determined to not let it ruin my day yeah. to, like, like i myself said you'll go up. to sleep and be like at least like i know. You know i got things done i did like you know you still had a good day yeah like i'm still a little bit upset at the moment like i've got this horrible kind of like feeling just weighing on my chest of just I guess sadness like i just feel a little bit sad but anyway I just wanted to tell you guys that because I feel like it's nice to know that not everything's perfect. Yeah. You know? Not everything. I'll show you the ups yeah. and the downs. Even though I had a really good day, I've also had kind of a bad day. But, you know, we're going to make sure it's a good day. It's going to be better. So All right. It around. Let's go. This is what we're checking out. We're just going to borrow a few pieces that we can shoot in. I love it. We've got all these shoes absolutely spoiled i just got home but before i get out and say bye to chelsea i thought i would do a little haul of the stuff i picked up from the pr company so first of all chelsea and i got little matching t-shirts mm. these are really cute they're from general pants i just got a white one chelsea got a little kind of like purpley one bluish lilac and then i picked up this really cute little cropped hoodie from guess it just looks like this and it says guess i love that that's so i know cute. i love that too I got a little crocheted set, like shorts and a black top. If you can, there you go. Santa. Then I picked up this little top, which is really cute. It had a matching set, but then the pants didn't fit my butt. They were like a size for a toddler. <laughs> Not cute. My life. I picked up a black dress, which I actually really like this. Oh, great GI. Black sleeve dress, tight, casual, or dressed Very up. Very nice. Take a pick. <laughs> And then I got these pants from Tiger Lily that are just kind of long and flowy. They're just like this. So, you know, you'll probably see these items on my Instagram. Really cute. So make sure you go follow my Instagram, Ella underscore Victoria. I'm going to go inside now and I might just like, you know, take my makeup off and chill out because I'm a bit drained from today. Like I just need some time for myself to chill out. Um, I'll probably watch Younger on Stan because that seems to be what I do when like I'm not feeling great. Like it's my escapism just to watch Younger. I don't know. Make a team. Oh yeah. It'll be like nice. Love it. Nice yeah. Vibe. And we're so hungry. We haven't eaten any oh lunch. God. So I'm going to go in and eat. <laughs> hey everyone. So it's the next day. I wanted to pick up the camera to update you guys on my hair and show you how it's looking because I just did my first wash and obviously this is a washout color. I say obviously, but I never actually mentioned that. It is actually a washout color. So every time I wash it, it's going to get a little bit lighter, but I actually like it even more now I've washed it. I think it looks a lot more subtle and I feel like my hair looks even shinier like it kind of looks silver 
um, but it's got like a little bit of a purple tint so it's not like really obviously in your face purple not that it was like that in the first place but I just think it's a little bit more subtle now but the reason that I've just washed my hair is because I'm going out let's be honest I probably wouldn't wash it otherwise because I'm lazy um, but Brayden and I are going out this afternoon with some friends to Frosé in the city so we're just getting ready to go right now and I thought I might as well bring you guys along mm -hmm. 